Ed, congratulations on signing that contract <laughs> extension. You've got a little cutie next to you. Who is this? This is Eva Rain. Hello, Eva. I'm trying to teach her how to say go Bills. <laughs> Ed, what was your reaction to signing that four-year contract extension with the Bills? An emotional day, a wonderful day for you as a Buffalo Bill. I mean, I, I'm still lost for words right now. Just, just being here, my family here to support me, just doing something that I always wanted to do that was so far away when I was a little kid and just finally getting to this day. It seemed like this day happened so fast, but I just remember so long ago, seven, eight years ago, just thinking like, man, what if I get to resign? I was a first round draft pick and it just came so fast. It's just so surreal. First round draft pick and signing that contract extension with the team that drafted you. Who's the first person that you told when you found out the news? Uh, I, I think Mark, uh, my brother Marcus, I'm pretty sure he was like the first one I sent like the details to. Every time um, they sent me an offer or something, I sent it to my brother first, and he we were just talking back and forth. And when I sent when I sent him the final offer, he was like, right, bro, "It's good. It's a lot of money. You know what I'm saying? You got what you wanted." And I was like, "All right." And I agreed to. I really ain't need nobody else but his approval because he the one that been there with me, basically put the football in my hands way back. And if he say, "All right," then it's all right. What have the reactions been like from your teammates? It's just been crazy because this is something we talked about. Like, man, I want to stay here. I want to get paid here. And just for it to actually happen, it's just everybody was just proud for me, just excited for me. <clears throat> I wasn't here to, like, actually be in the locker room and celebrate with them, but I just waiting to get down there because I know they're going to be big money. Da, da, da. You know how the, just the locker room talk go. So I just can't wait to get down there to them guys. Think back to being a first-round draft pick in 2019. How much have you grown since coming to Buffalo in that first season? Uh, it, night and day. <laughs> Even everybody in the building can tell you just night and day, just growing the love for Buffalo, growing the love to be here, embracing the cold, learning to, learning to know what to expect when the cold comes and just the fans and how tight-knit community this is and just – Everything about Buffalo was the reason why I was like, man, no, I'm, I want to get paid here. I don't want to hit the market, go somewhere. I want to get paid here. So that's why I'm very happy with my decision. All right, you've got the extension. So what are we doing on the field this year? You know, we ain't going to put no projections, but uh, that incentive say, hey, sacks a half a million. I got to get that. So, <laughs> that, so you know, and then, you know, we also want to put hardware on the finger as the team goes. So. You know, we just going to go out there with the same mindset, playoff caliber, championship caliber, and uh, hopefully get it done. You've got some great teammates alongside you on the defensive line. How do they make you a better defensive tackle? You know, you got Greg, Stretch Armstrong. <laughs> then on the other side, you got Crane. He's an OG in the game. You got Daquan. He's an OG in the game. Like, our room is getting older, and we just, we just evolve. We got AJ. You got Boogie. All of us are getting older, we're evolving, we're becoming better football players. So just to watch us grow and compete is just, it, every, everybody makes everybody better. Last question for you, are we adding more horses to the stable? Oh, you know, I'm gonna go buy one right now. <laughs> nah, no, no lie though, I did buy one a couple of days ago, so I think I'm good on horses. <laughs> Ed, congratulations. Thank you. Go Bills. <laughs>